YouTube, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you or talking to you, to you guys about what happened uh, today with uh, Apple and, uh, you know, the big history, I guess you could say, was made. And, you know, just what kind of happens. I just want to talk to you guys about that real quick. And, you know, so uh, this truly, I don't know if it's necessarily unforgettable like Apple said it was going to be, but it definitely is a, a, a pretty big day in uh, history, I guess, for music. And that uh, the Beatles is now on iTunes. And that was the big announcement. I was expecting something really cool and exciting, you know, like streaming or, you know, you know. But anyway, we have the Beatles on iTunes, so. <laughs> and that's pretty well it. So now the entire Beatles catalog. This isn't just one CD. This isn't, you know, just a little bit of it. The entire Beatles catalog is now on iTunes. So you can pretty well look at. You can buy the entire box set for $149 on iTunes. It's got an i it has an L an iTunes LP with it. So you've got all kinds of videos and information with it. They even have a ping account. Which I don't know how a bunch of dead guys can have a ping account, but they do. And that's pretty well it. You know, that's kinda of taught and you can go on Apple.com and read a little bit of history about the Beatles and watch a a video or two about them until uh, I think till the end of 2010 and then get to pay to watch them I think through iTunes if that's about it video but uh, other than that that's really all that happened today there's no iOS 4.2 there's no Apple TV update there's no streaming that's it the only thing is the Beatles and um, you know for some people that's really exciting you're not gonna get some high quality remastered Beatles hits for some people, they could care less. They really wanted something ten times more exciting. And to be honest, I really was not expecting this. Uh, I, the way I thought that this has been rumored forever, uh, you know, I pretty well given it up. And but totally wrong. And Apple, I think, likes to prove me wrong. So that's what they're doing. <laughs> All right. So let's quickly talk about my giveaway here. I'm going to do this really quick, you know, because I've already done a video of this. And I just want to add a few different things to this, and we'll be done. So the giveaway will go down. Uh, Thursday, November 18th at 7 p.m. Central. That would be 8 p.m. Eastern and I believe uh, 5 p.m. Pacific. If I'm wrong, I'll make sure I change that in the video uh, annotation. Sorry. So uh, just make sure you uh, you don't have to be present, but I really encourage you to come on out. I'll just be talking with you guys. You guys can ask me questions, Apple or not, tech, non-tech. You know, I just like to talk with you guys and we'll have some fun. Uh, other than that, I uh, just just make sure, you know, you're active on YouTube, you know, because first of all, I'm going to send you an email or, or a PM on on a YouTube. All you have to do is respond to that within 48 hours. I'll send you the code right along, no big deal, and you get your iTunes gift card. If you don't uh, re reply within 48 hours, that lets me know, okay, this account's inactive, nobody's using it, and I'm just throwing away $10 if I throw it right at you. So just make sure you respond within 48 hours. I'm giving you plenty of time to do that. Just make sure you do that, and uh, we'll all be good, and you'll have a good time. Maybe you can buy some new Beatles uh, music, which would be really neat. So I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to thumbs up, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.